Aston Martin's WEC victory weight with new Vantage felt like 1,000 years. The wait for Aston Martin to secure the first World Endurance Championship win with its new Vantage GTE felt like a thousand years, says Ricky Bean. Aston's new for 2018 contender took its first GTE Pro victory on Sunday in a rainy, disrupted Shanghai race on only its fifth attempt, after a largely difficult year for the British mark which included an uncompetitive showing at the Le Mans 24 hours and a disappointing Fuji race that was compromised by a bad strategic call. Aston chose to split its strategies at Shanghai, an approach that ultimately meant Nicky Thiem and Marco Sorensen took victory in the Hash 95 car while Max Sein Martin and Alex Lin, hurt by having to take a pit stop under green flag running, ended up fourth behind both Porsche. It's quite emotional I have to say says Diem of the Shanghai win. I haven't felt like this since we won the championship in 2016 in Bahrain. We made a big step from Silverstone, couldn't finish it off at Fuji, but now we did it. We did exactly the right moves under the safety car and so on. We didn't get the strategy right in Fuji. It sounds like a few races but it felt like a thousand years. To be honest I didn't expect it would take so long, to win, with the new car. We're still learning, and finishing off, the year, with a win now is the best thing could happen. We've got to keep improving especially for Sabring. The Hash 95 Aston Martin finished the Shanghai event 7th overall, ahead of the best of the LMP2S. The Hash 38 Jackie Chan DC Racing Oreca shared by Stefan Rishilmi, Gabriel Aubrey and Hope Hinto. Sorensen said he knew he had to pass the Hash 38 machine in the closing stages because he was being held up. It was actually becoming a little bit of a problem, after the safety car the tire pressures were so low, it was cold, it was raining and you couldn't bring the tires up to them.